Reptar. Halt, I am Reptar. Halt, I am Reptar. Get him, Reptar! Now, at a recent store closing, I managed to purchase an HD video recorder. Originally $250, but thanks to the miracle of bankruptcy and Schadenfreude, I managed to get it for the low price of $56. Bucks. I went home with the ultimate capture device while others went home employed with nothing but a bottle of vodka and bleach, a sacrifice I was willing to accept. Instead of using this incredible device to take footage of the most intense graphical powerhouse ever flattened into a Blu-ray disc, I decided to review one of the ugliest PS1 games I could find, Rugrats in Search of Reptar for the PlayStation. <laughs> to the typical gamer, it's really an okay adventure game. You walk around your child death prone home unaccompanied as Tommy, venturing potentially dangerous locations without adult supervision, and a goal to gain all the pieces of the Reptar puzzle which should be a choking hazard to Tommy and anyone else under three. What's wrong? Either a lot of the puzzle pieces are missing, or it's the easiest puzzle ever. I sort of wonder how these kids manage to survive 10 TV seasons, 3 movies, and a spin-off without social services being called. Child safety is a total joke to these parents and they're never around. But now it's time to go night night. This game has some of the most unresponsive and glitchy controls ever with a camera that's held by a drunk. I like to pretend Tommy's dad, Stu, had one too many failed toy experiments and decided to go on a drunkard tape recorded rampage terrorizing Tommy through the house. <laughs> You know, with the camera and controls combined, it really does enhance the game a little. You really feel like a toddler just learning how to walk. The stages consist mostly of collecting objects or getting to the end and maybe a few mini games like golf. Want some ice cream? Psych. Sometimes it's unclear on what to do and even has some very strange glitches. To the average gamer, it's pretty easy and kind of fun. But to a 90s Nick fan, it's a nostalgic tribute to the series. Remember the Rugrats trying to get a hole in one at Ice Cream Mountain? Or the episode where Tommy and Chucky get locked in a toy store and there was a freaking time machine in there? Remember when Stu nearly created Judgment Day with a legion of clown robots? Oh boy, a brand new friend to me. You can call me Mr. Friend, you'll never ever be bored again. It may not be the most well crafted, but it's perfect for any fans of the original show, so definitely search this one out. Oh, and here comes a spoiler. This'll be our little secret, eh, Spot? Once you beat this innocent, nostalgic game where you run around as a little baby collecting cookies and puzzle pieces, you get to destroy the freaking city as Reptar the Dinosaur! Reptar is ravaging the city. Never in my entire career as a reporter have I seen such destruction. Of course, I only started yesterday. <laughs> and your reward for doing untold amounts of damage to the city and its citizens? You can see Reptar dance. Twenty ten's gonna be a rough year. Here we go, kids! Terrence Turtle is my name! Turtle dancing, that's my game! Come on, kids! Everybody do the turtle dance! Not having a good time? <laughs> Play the Rugrats video game instead, with characters like Tommy, Chucky, even Angelica. Rugrats Search for Reptar. It's a 3D adventure, and it's only on PlayStation. PlayStation!